previously on Tech Makeover. Once needs completely implemented, the pitfalls are the important piece of paper that doesn't get scanned. They've got to be very careful that they do capture all of it, because if not, those are the things that lead to more questions from prying eyes. I'm not the most tech savvy guy in the world. I know how to use a computer. I know how to use our POS system that we have now. We know there's products out there, but we just don't know what the technology is. It would be really great if somebody could come in and explain to us what's out there so we know what to use to help our business get better. When it comes to technology, I'm not the best at it, and I never have been. But when I know it can make me money, I'll take the time to figure it out and use all the tools I can get from it. It's time for a tech makeover. Trish is facing one of the most difficult times of any implementation, dead middle. You've worked yourself hard to get solutions half implemented. The client isn't yet seeing the full benefit of the solutions that you're putting in, but they're tired. They've been trying to run a business while they've been trying to help you. Everybody's irritable, everybody's tired, but Patricia, if she can pour on the extra energy, keep the troops rallied, stay positive, she'll get the client to the finish line. So one of the fun things about the NEAT scanner is that you can go anywhere with it. You don't have to be tied to your computer. So as a little experiment, we took the NEAT scanner out to the back patio and we sat down at that back table and scanned in those receipts. On my computer, I showed them instantly how those receipts were going right to the cloud and accessible to them. But not only to them, their CPA at that point could also see those receipts immediately. They didn't have to package them up and mail them. They were done with them. They could throw them away. What we're going to do is go ahead and scan these in. Now on the NEAT scanner, you have options on where it gets scanned to. So I'm, I've selected the NEAT cloud. If I had my computer tied to it, I'd be able to, to move this over to computer and scan it right directly onto my computer. Okay, now this is a little bit wider than my regular receipt. So I'm going to use my guides. I might have to help it out just a little bit there. And then you just hit the scan button. See the little arrow that pops up when it detects the paper? Okay, and that one comes in, then I can hit send. So the couple of the things here on these settings that you want to watch, there's three things for you to, to pick here, color or black and white, one-sided or two-sided, so if you've got notes on the back, right, and then separate or together. So because we were on separate, these are going to scan in as three separate invoices okay. okay now when that when those download into QuickBooks online you'll get three separate bills and then you'll write one check to pay the three bills and will it be able to communicate with each other to to realize that those three invoices were paid by one check that'll be done in QuickBooks online okay because neat doesn't know anything about the summary page of this right okay so really what this is doing is just getting my document into the system okay all right, now let's come over here to the Neat Cloud, okay? And I'm gonna look in the From Neat Connect. These are different, all the different ways that you can get receipts or documents into Neat. So you can email it to your assigned, actually a Neat Cloud account, a, a, an email. And if you email something that someone's emailed to you, like a PDF invoice, it'll go straight into Neat. And you won't even have to print it and scan it or anything. If I'm selecting the From Neat Connect, that's this device here. It's a Neat Connect. If I'm selecting From Neat Mobile, that's something you took a picture of on your phone. And then if I'm doing Web Import, then it would I would select that one. So in this case, I'm going to select From Neat Connect. And you see, I've got three items that are processing right, right now. And that'll take them just a second to do. A couple of things I would like to point out to you. So yeah, look at um, that. It knows exactly what they are. It does. It, it picks up the name, like this is the Louisiana Dispenser invoice here. So it actually picked up the name of that vendor and entered it in as the vendor in the Neat Connect. And then once the receipt comes in, we can click on it. We get a, a view over here of the scanned image. We can zoom in on that so we can see it a little bit better. And you can move it around if you need to look at different things on there. And then on the left hand side here, you see it selected the vendor. So if this is, um, this might not be the exact same name as the vendor that you have in QuickBooks Online, okay? I, and so what we have to do is connect the two right. systems together. Now I've got, the, I've got the two systems connected, 
but you have to map and say Louisiana dispenser in NEAT equals Louisiana dispenser or LA uh, dispenser. It might be LA dispenser exactly, in the other one. Right? In the other one. So and that's only a one-time deal. It is. It's the smart parsing technology that NEAT has built into their system that is very, very hard to find out there in the industry. And, and very powerful for you because it means that you don't have to go in and interpret every single receipt, right? I think it's going to help my relationship with my CPA now that we have need. Because before he said I didn't send it, I said I sent it, and we'd be fighting over it. Now he's going to know he has it, I'm going to know he has it, and I'm going to hold him responsible. One of the things that impresses me, I guess, most about the NEAT system is, is that it works. I can go right into the system and find out exactly what that expense item is, and that gives me comfort in knowing that their financial statements are correct and the, the information that's going into the financial statements by using the NEAT system. Patricia has done a tremendous job developing trust with Brad and Steve. Seeing the file cabinets roll out of the business helped us to know they've embraced the future. I'm a 21st century business owner. Patricia is a 21st century business owner. We always are on the cutting edge of technology. To walk in and see that much paper not in its proper place was very unnerving to us. So we're halfway through the week and we've got the NEAT solution installed. But now we've still got when I work for their scheduling. So the pressure's on, we've only got a couple of days left before our deadline. We're starting to feel the heat. So we've cleaned up your office and that feels really good. Uh, we've used the NEAT scanner and the NEAT cloud software to document everything and keep everything in order. So now we've got to talk about your scheduling. So we knew when we saw that paper schedule hanging on the wall that we needed to do something with their scheduling. And in a restaurant environment, the schedules are crazy. The shifts are turning all the time. This bar is open from 10 o'clock in the morning all the way until after midnight. That means they're running as many as three shifts a day. And when you're tending bar on Bourbon Street, the unpredictable is going to happen. We knew if they could get the people they need when they need them and get them quickly, they were gonna make more money. And When I Work was the best fit for this. So I did something unconventional with When I Work. And I thought the best way to get their confidence up in the software is to force a situation where they had to use it. During this episode, we saw a pro advisor making a big difference in the life of her clients. And she did this because she had the skills not just to manage the technology, but to manage the client relationship. At Woodard Institute, our premier coaching program, we get you beyond the what you should do and the why you should do it to the cutting edge how. How to be a future ready practice. How to manage difficult client situations and how to accelerate your practice into the future. So join Woodard Institute today to take your practice to the next level.